you know, speaking from Blackstone as an example, and I think Jesus was was spot on on his analogy towards a fitting cart. You know, that you got to get it out there and get get it in front of your team. Um, for us, you know, when when we before you maybe had myself, maybe one other assistant, or possibly a merchandiser who was solely in charge of ordering special orders and kind of tracking that process. So it was almost like those one or two people kind of had a stranglehold on the operation. Um, you had, you know, we've got a lot of young people in the golf industry who are eager to get experience and get training to help advance their careers. And so we used it as a way to saying, hey, you know, we're not specialized in any one area. If you're a member of the golf shop team, everyone can have access to golf shop genius and can place orders and can follow up with members. And just like Jesus mentioned before, just having the team have constant visibility into the process and where those orders are in the pipeline uh, gives makes everybody an expert. So any any member or customer can go up to any, to any one of our assistants and say, hey, what's the status of this order? Where's my Titleist wedge? Where's that? They can pull it up right away, whether it be on their phone or on the golf shop computer. And now they're an expert and they're not passing it along down the way. Um, and that just kind of gets them more involved in the whole operation. So now members are now coming to assistant a, B, and C for answers, whether then, well, when's Patrick going to be in so I can ask him the question. That So nobody likes to be passed over when a member comes to an assistant and says, well, I got to talk to Patrick. Now I have three or four very capable people who can place orders, be involved in the process, and answer those type of questions.